Now, Southern California is home to the largest community of Koreans outside of Korea. One of the best known Korean Americans in the state is best selling author and artist Heli Lee. Uh, Huang Jie reporting from us, Los Angeles, had the chance to meet with her. Jie. Yes, Mark, I did have a chance to sit down with Heli, and we had a nice chat about her experiences. A mother of four year old twins, she bursts with pride about her bicultural heritage. Born in Seoul, Heli Lee was only four years old when her family moved to Montreal, Canada in 1968. After a year, the family settled in Los Angeles, and since then, her journey in search of her roots started. Heli's bestseller, Still Life with Rice and In the Absence of Sun, are also about her family's experience in Korea from the 1930s under Japan's colonial rule through the Korean War and until the late 1990s. English was never something that I I grasped or felt I had a talent towards, but it is ironically the thing that I became as an adult, and it is because of stories of my family. Heli says a sense of identity, knowing where she comes from as a Korean, made her what she is today and will be tomorrow. And if you don't understand who you are, you can't be present. And if you can't be present, there is no way you can envision a future. And I want to envision a future for myself. I want to envision a future for my twins. I want to envision a future for my community. And so it is crucial that we understand the metal of our back. On that note, you lived as a man for more than six months. Um, tell me about your experience as a man and why did you do that? You no, know, I thought men had it better, boys had it better. And when I had the opportunity, I decided to experience that and to prove that what I was thinking was true. I wasn't true. No, the moment I did the transformation, I lived as a man for about six and a half months. For the first month, it was very fun. You know, like every new experience, it was very fun. Everything seemed new, everything tasted new, um, looked new. But once I actually became absorbed in my male character, I realized that it, it is not always better on the other side of the fence. As a male, Heli learned there is an image of masculinity that men always have to carry with them, and there are certain limitations that are not acknowledged by society. Drawing on her experiences, Heli performed a one woman show in Hollywood that was so successful that it ran for six months instead of the four week run she had originally planned. Heli hopes to contribute to the society by sharing her experiences. She says she wants to be a humanitarian, a good wife, a good daughter, and a a mother and make the world and at least her community a better place. Mark? Well, thank you very much, GA. That was our Huang GA reporting from Los Angeles on the life and experiences of best selling Korean American author Heli Lee.